everything you need to know about the Frosty Frenzy in under two minutes. So it's across two days and there are four rounds. Each of these rounds have two sessions as well. So overall there are eight sessions and none of these sessions overlap each other. The first round of all four sessions is two hours and six matches and in the big regions you must come in the top 500 to qualify through to round two and in the smaller regions you need to come in the top 250. Round two is then three hours and ten matches. The prize pool in EU is top 400 make money so it's a lot easier for many players to make a lot of earnings here. So if you place between 400th and 36th you'll make $400 each. If you place 35 or above you'll make $600 each. And in any East, the placement thresholds are placing 250th and then 25th for again, the same amount of money each. And if you play any of the rounds and get five points, you'll get the Scully Claws spray. Day one's format is slightly different from days two, where it's 15 eliminations equals a win. And there's a lot of the placement is much more heavily based towards the top. Day two's format is exactly the same as the FNCS trios in terms of placements to eliminations. The tournament is open to any players, so you don't need to be in contenders or champions to do it and it is not platform based which means all platforms will be playing in the same tournament. It is region locked so you can only play one tournament. Day one will be much more W key because there's only 15 eliminations per win and it's open so that first game people are going to be W keying a lot. I also would guess that we're going to see a lot of people qualify purely by starting late and getting one or two massive elimination games in the opens. If you want to start late, I'd recommend starting about half an hour late. Remember, there are four different opens tournaments that you can try this in. So if something doesn't work out for you in one game, maybe don't try that another time. But I'd recommend starting about half an hour late if you're going to W key. If you're not going to W key, don't start late at all. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned a lot. Peace.